Do you have to pee pee? Would you like to go outside? Do you want to go outside? Yes? Yes? Okay, no fiddling around out there, right? You're gonna do your business. Like a good girl, right? We're not gonna do a half an hour walk. We're just gonna go out so that you can pee, right? You ready? Sadie is always ready to go outside when I ask her. <coughs> what I learned early on as her foster mom is that she wasn't the kind of dog who peed in, shall we say, a timely manner. Quite the opposite, actually. Are you going to come down the stairs? Come on. Good girl. Time to make a pee pee. We've been out here a while now. Do your business. You should be sniffing the grass to find just the right spot so that we can go in and have lunch. You know what, Sadie Grace? You remind me of Ferdinand the Bull. Yep, you just want to stop and smell the flower. Can't say flowers because there's literally only one. And you're sitting right beside it. Do you like flowers? So, do you think that you're going to pee? It would be really nice if you did. Sadie always peed eventually, and the act of peeing didn't seem to cause her any pain or distress. But in the first few weeks of her being with us, I couldn't help but wonder why it was taking her so long to get down to business. Okay, so you are supposed to be making a pee, and you have now decided but you're just gonna take a rest? What? Excuse me. Do you think we can keep it moving here? Come. Please. Before it rains. What are you waiting for? Come. Come here. Come here. Oh. You're cute, but you're stubborn. Okay, I'm ready to go in. Are you coming? Let's go. Let's go inside. Are you gonna come in with me? Apparently not. As sweet and submissive as she is, Little Miss was demonstrating that she can sometimes be stubborn like a mule, a very cute mule. Robin wondered if Sadie would pee faster for him than she was peeing for me. So he decided to try his hand at taking her out for some of her potty breaks. Neither of us believed that one of us held any more peeing persuasion capabilities than the other. And it certainly wasn't realistic for Robin to be the one to take her out the majority of the time given his busy work schedule. But it was very sweet of him to try. Did she pee yet? Nope, not yet. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's go. So? How'd it go? Well, she did it. It only took her 15 minutes this time. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, well, it's better than 20. Absolutely. It's progress. Yeah. Good okay. job. Come on, Good Sadie. Job. Come Let's on. Go inside. Oh, look, the sun's gonna come out after all the cloud. There we go. Okay, come on. Good job. So, are you happy? I am happy. Maybe she likes to pee with you more than she likes to pee with me. Wow. You know what this means, right? What's that? <laughs> oh no. I didn't think that went through. <laughs> oh, you just got yourself uh, another chore. Yeah, as if I don't have enough. <laughs> oh, I'm just joking. Well, sort of. All right. <laughs> we brought our concerns up with the vet, but they couldn't find anything medically wrong. In fact, Sadie peed quickly on their property and didn't dilly dally around whatsoever. So why on earth was she not peeing on our grass with the same level of enthusiasm? We didn't understand what the problem was. What are you doing? What are you thinking? Do you have to ponder about peeing? Hmm? What's there to think about? Instead of continuing to use the neck collar Sadie came with, we bought her two similar but different harnesses in the hopes that she would be more comfortable during pee walks outside. 
The black one served as a travel harness, which was an added bonus. The purple one had kangaroos on it, which just made it super cute. We couldn't bear the thought of hurting her neck, so we were happy to put the neck collar away. Are you coming down? Are you going to come with mommy? Oh, is the truck construction noise scaring you? It's very loud. I think they're building a house not too far away from us. There's been a lot of digging, a lot of beeping. I don't think she likes it. Say, Grace, you gonna come down? You gonna come down? Let's go. Come on, sweetness. Come on. Let's go make your pee. Oh, sweet what you doing? What you doing? Come on. Come down the stairs. You silly girl. You silly girl. Do you want mommy to carry you? Huh? Oh, you want mommy to carry you? Oh, look at that. Hmm? Silly. Let's go, okay? Don't be afraid. It's okay. Oh, it's okay. Let's go, okay? Come with mom. Come with me. Let's go. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on, sweetie. Come on. Oh, she's not pushing. Can you please come down the stairs? Hmm? Can you please? Please? Okay, what if I run? Here, I'm gonna put your leash down. Now what if I run? City Grace! City Grace! Come on! Let's go! Let's go! What are you doing? What are you doing? What's the game? Hmm? Is it, please pick me up? Okay. You're just so cute. I will do it. I will pick you up. Okay? I will give you the princess service that you deserve. Hmm? Little miss, I carried you down. You gonna do your pee now? Let's go. Let's go. I began incentivizing her with praise and treats every time she finally gave in and peed on the grass in the hopes that it would speed up the process next time around. But she continued to take her sweet time. Sadie enjoyed looking outside, but she never took the initiative to ask to go out. She didn't alert me when she had to go potty. I had to ask her. Oh, what a big stretch. Do you want to go out? Do you want to go outside? Do you? Do you want to go out? Is that a yes? Do you want to go out? Tell me. Tell me. Tell Mama. What do you want? <coughs> okay. Tell me. <coughs> Tell me again. gonna put on my shoes and then we're gonna go out okay as you wish sweetie look at that tail go you're so sweet yes so sweet thankfully it didn't take long to realize why Sadie wasn't enjoying peeing on our lawn Sadie peed much sooner and more frequently when we were off property you're leading the way Yep, up the hill we go. Two acres of grass just couldn't compare to what walks on the road had to offer. It wasn't the smell of wildflowers that caught her attention and stopped her in her tracks. 
It was the smell of urine from other dogs, the very thing we didn't have on our property. It's quite a little sniffer. Let's keep going. Come on. Let's go. You gonna squeeze out a little more juice? Oh yeah, of course. Yep. I think we've left Grandma in the dust. I'm here. Gotta wait for Grandma. Here's Grandma. Sadie was clearly demonstrating that she had a peeing preference. In her heart of hearts, our sweet little delicate feminine foster dog was a roadside urinator. That is your chance to be rude. Hey kid, don't ever let them get inside your head. They'll tell you what to do in life instead. She wasn't a grass girl. Over time, I've come to realize that this is more than just a peeing preference. Sadie demonstrates some rather obvious urine marking behaviors. Yep, there she goes. Marking her territory. Good job. Good job. Yep, my little urine marker. It's what she likes to do. She's about to mark again. She's picking up on something she doesn't like that she wants to cover. She never just pees once on our walks. She pees multiple times. Yep, sure enough, I knew it. Wow, that was barely 60 seconds after the first marking. Okay, you're on a roll, little miss. And sometimes she even lifts her leg ever so slightly. Wow, you even lifted your leg that time. Good girl. I think she's a dog on a mission. She wants to cover as many previous peers as she possibly can. I thought so. That's my girl. Cover it up. Yep. Some dog dared to pee at the end of our driveway. Yeah, you gotta fix that. While research indicates that urine marking is typically a male dog behavior, some unspayed female dogs exhibit the behavior too, more so when they are in heat, and sometimes due to anxiety. Sadie came to us unspayed, but she wasn't in a heat cycle when I recorded any of this video. She is, however, an anxious dog, still healing from past trauma and still adjusting to only having one eye. I believe Sadie's desire to urine mark is her way of telling other dogs to back off and leave her alone. Yeah, you're all done, right? You all done peeing? Did you cover up enough sense from other dogs? I also believe this is one of her ways of demonstrating appreciation for her new living environment. I think she finally feels like she is home. And if that means she wants to pee like the boys, then so be it. More power to her. Interestingly enough, she has never had a problem pooping in the backyard. We think Sadie's urine marking is kind of cute. It's harmless. And even though she much prefers the road, she is starting to pee on the grass with a little more ease than she did when she first came to us. I'd like to end this lighthearted video on a humorous note. So I thought I'd share with you that word has gotten out about Little Miss's urine marking behavior. And rumor has it, she's got a bit of a fan club. If you have any doggy potty stories you'd like to share, we'd love to hear them. Sadie Grace can't be the only dog out there with some quirks when it comes to her peeing preferences and potty habits. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and feel free to comment below. We'd love to hear from you. You can also subscribe to our channel. Be sure to hit the bell button so you'll be alerted each time we post a new video. Be well and we'll see you next time.